Got it. Yeah. All right, this is the brush mower we bought. It's, um, what's it, a swisher? It's, we got it so we can clean off a lot of that land. There's a lot of trees, a lot of saplings up there that we need to get cleaned up. And we're gonna do all this tomorrow morning. We're gonna unbox it and we're gonna have it all done. It'll be about eight hours for us. It'll be like that for you guys. That was a whole lot of dust and gravel. <laughs> well, stay tuned. <laughs> no, you didn't. Go ahead and... middle one right here I'll step down here I don't want to cut none of them lines. Should be pretty loose. Should come off. That's that cobalt working right there. Oh yeah. Yeah, if it been in. If it been the other one, you would like. Don't jump on it. 
<laughs> okay. Go ahead and take all this off of here. Yeah. Okay, we need something to... Well, that one's already cut. Well, with all our nuts and bolts we need, hose, I think that's all the zip ties. Okay, there's that. Give me one more. That's about right, right there. Should be. Alright, the nuts. This is just more or less of a mock-up to get it off of the truck. Can you hold that right, like right there? That was a nice 16 in the house. <coughs> yeah, but this is just to get it off of here. We'll tighten everything up. Thank you. 
this one. Okay. Need some zip ties later and like zip tied up. Yep. That's reverse. There's neutral right there. There we go. Right. The gas feed. Okay. Well, there's all that part. Lost oh, the drive motor. That works out. We're gonna move the truck up there to where I told you yesterday, and we're just gonna pull it right off. Still a little bit of a drop, but not as much as it was. Yeah, it's not like a ramp. I got one. Maybe it'll work. I missed. That way to give us a little bit of a start. Yeah. Hold up. Pull.
Okay. Now we can get to it. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> Both to work. Yep, work good. Cherry tree done pretty good this year. I had about well, I had a good many cherries, but the birds got to them. We'll tighten all that up later and get everything ready for it. Away, and we'll check out this this mower and tighten up all the stuff on it. It's a self-propelled brush mower. And right now it's in neutral. We'll take it over here somewhere where we can look at it. Over here in the open. Got to figure out where I want, where I'll be most comfortable. I believe right here where it's at, you know? Yeah. So we'll just go ahead and tighten all this up. That is, looks like a half. I think I had a half. That's a seven, eight, there it is. Just tighten these up. There it is, half. <clears throat> I'm not going to start it up today. I'm going to test it out maybe later on. I'm going to need another half for that one. Same with that one. Okay. And you got a couple right here. We're gonna need another half inch to tighten that one and those two down there. But it's a Swisher Predator 24. It's a rugged cut four speed transaxle. So we'll just check everything. I like to check, make sure it does have oil in it and it's got a little bit of an oil leak down here. I believe so. We'll run it on this oil for maybe about five hours, then we'll change it. I'm gonna hide it. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I know um, we're gonna enjoy all this stuff when um, it comes time for us to get up there and actually do some work on that land, actually clean it off for the properties. I know it's a good investment. I'm glad I bought it and hope you all got all you guys are being safe and today is my mom's birthday and with the day this video goes live it should be the day after her birthday but happy birthday anyway mom and we'll catch all you guys on the next one bye